When we walked down to the beach and saw the yacht, it was like, truly, you're gonna use the yacht for Brit? Seems like a waste of a one-on-one, -on -one, if you ask me. That's a big boat. Oh, I'm so jealous. Brit and Brad. Although it sounds really cute, not only do I not see them getting married, I don't know if I even see them friending each other on Facebook. That was a clip from next week's Bachelor. Wow. Wow, man. That, they're, they're harsh on you. They are harsh on me. I was just defending sweet Michelle. And then she, that, you, you know? did you see that for the first time? Oh, yes, sir. That's, that's a first. How about that? That's so a first. Where's the Bachelor going next week? Uh, we are in the beautiful island of Anguilla. It's so nice and so pretty. And actually, we were able to do a photo shoot for Sports Illustrated. Three of the women were able to be in the uh, swimsuit edition. Yes. So, I mean, every woman's dream, and, and I was very thankful to uh, have witnessed that. Let's take, a look at, let's take a look at these pictures. Here, look straight ahead, Brad. Oh! Wow. Wow. That's hot. You know what? I don't know how you wear white swim trunks and don't have any activity down there. <laughs> Thank God for Under Armour compression shorts. You know, no, I'm, kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. So, so those, those are exclusive photos. They come out in Sports Illustrated in the swimsuit edition on the 15th. Wow, man. Now, now, Michelle, there's a picture of Michelle. I Beautiful. can't decide if she's hot or crazy. Uh, what do you guys? What, what do you guys think? Hot? Maybe both. Spoken like a true I man. Think... Some guy yelled out, "Both!" <laughs> crazy hot. So I, I know you're not allowed to talk about the outcome of the show because you, you, you do get in trouble, right? Yes, sir, I do. But, but I will tell you this, that I can't stand in the way of true love. And, and, and I, I, I kind of hate to do this to you, but love is love. And, and love will always <laughs> find a way to make itself present. And I want to bring out one of the women that you didn't choose. And, I, and I'm sorry, but I, I, I got to do this because I think this is, this is a connection that that deserves to be together. So everybody, would you please put your hands together and welcome out, welcome out a bachelorette, Neutrogena Vega, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Let's do this right here. <laughs> you got Let's big see. shoes, this too. Right. Let me tell you something. I had to pass a drug test, a background check, and you still eliminated me. Oh, God. Oh, <laughs> well, you know what? Wow. Look, looking at you, thank God they didn't have a credit check. Uh, anyway. <laughs> okay. Back it up, Pepe Lopez. <laughs> Okay, I don't even know why you got a goatee on your face. You're not 35. <laughs> okay. Yeah, right. I'm telling you. All right, wait a minute. I didn't bring you out here so you could yell at my guests or pick on me, Neutrogena. Oh, hell no. It's not about you, boo. Hey, boo. Listen, I don't know why you eliminated me. I mean, am I not good enough for you? Look at this. Uh, you know, something tells me you're going to do just fine in the dating world. You don't need me. You don't really? need me. No, Come not at all. Come on. Listen, we have so have many this. things in common, okay? Is that so? And I know you have to build a relationship when you have things in common. I watch Maury Povich. That's what he says. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It's true. Let me tell you something. For one, you said you like to have kids. Yes. I yes. want kids one day. You yes. do? Yes, I do. Well, let me tell you something. I need someone to watch my kids while I get my nails done. <laughs> <laughs> I can do that. Get can a little closer. That? Come on. Too, okay, you giving out roses to skinny white girls? Uh -huh. Mercy. I saw that. I saw that. We have this in common because I sell them to skinny white girls outside the club <laughs> on a Saturday night. It's honest money. Wait a minute, where, 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 where would you take him on a date? Because you seem like the aggressor. Where would you take him? You know, I might have a coupon somewhere. It depends. <laughs> Olive Garden, you all right? I'm nervous. You kidding me? You all right? What do you think? I'm doing just fine. You, right? I, I, I'm nervous. you, you own bars in Austin, right? Oh, you own bars? I dance on bars. Oh, yes. She's quick. She's quick. She's quick. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All that it's, it's and... A, a weave will do that. But, oh, hell no. I like this. See, I can just sit here and be quiet. <laughs> you guys are firing Let back and forth. Let me tell you something, boo. Please also, do. you know, I noticed I seen you on TV, and you're not very good at making decisions. 
I what noticed that. I noticed yeah. that. But you is know that what? True? Did, she, is she, did she nail it? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not the best at making decisions. That's not okay, because I like to tell cute white boys what to do. Hey! Okay. <laughs> mm-hmm. I, know I, like why, I know why I didn't get picked for the show, okay? Why's that? Because those other girls, they fight with words and schemes and all that stuff, you know what I mean? When I get down, I take my jewelries off. <laughs> I get my baby to the camera guy. I'm like, getting into it. I'm the last bitch standing, hey! That's it. She's tough. Right. Neutrogena. All right, go ahead. I'll have her meet you in the back. Everybody, oh, Neutrogena so. Vega. <laughs> see why you eliminated her. That was fun. I wish you the best of luck. Uh, thanks for coming on and answering some questions. I think everybody appreciates your candor. Thank you Brad very Womack. much. Thank you. 